People keep asking if I'm back, and I haven't really had an answer. But now, yeah, I'm thinking I'm back, back, back. If I tell you I'm good, probably you will say I'm boasting. But if I tell you I'm no good, you know one line. <laughs> Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Dr. PGNG. I'm praise God to get money back for another YouTube video. Banger, man. Yes, sir. Yes, man. I don't know what time it is. The doctor's in the house, man. It looks like it's about to rain, you know what I'm saying, momentarily. But that's all right because this is a short video anyway, man. I just, I just here to drop some breaking news, you know. According to, you know, Devin Haney, the man himself, he said that he's going to make a return. He's making a return from the box and saying that he's been gone long enough, you know what I'm saying, and and he's ready to make a bounce back, man, you know what I'm saying. So I I, I think this would be good for him and his career, you know, because the last time we saw him, he was – um. He, he was the victim of of, 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 of of Ryan Garcia cheating, you know what I'm saying? It was a big controversy. It was unnecessary controversy. The man cheated. It is what it is. But in every sense of the word, you know, he was a victim and he, was, and he looked victimized, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but all jokes aside, you know what I'm saying? In all seriousness, you know, he was a victim of cheating and um, now he has bounced back, you know, as a result of of, 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 of that whole uh, situation, you know, the, the win that was initially went in favor of Ryan Garcia has been overturned to a no contest, you know, and so uh, Devin he said he's, he's going to return, you know, dropping hints on Twitter. And um, according to what I've been researching and seeing is that he may be re returning uh, more imminently than we anticipated. Or at least I anticipated. I thought maybe we'll see him again at the beginning of next year. But apparently he's coming back um, um, later on this year, particularly in November. You tell my girl, you I'll be gone till November. I'll be gone till November. I'll be gone till November. You know, and um, he could be returning with Big Turk Alashik, you know what I'm saying, on the on, on the uh, Riyadh card, you know, check out their interaction right here on Twitter. So yeah, man, he could be maker to return on Riyadh season faster than we think, and you know, th th there's been speculation that his opponent may be uh, Mario Barros, you know, a champion at 147. So not only could he return, but he could be he could be making a return at a higher weight division, you know, because of of course it's been well documented that um, making 140 hasn't been hasn't been the easiest thing for him to do, you know, and so man, you know, we we anticipate that he's probably going to move up, and he's been hinting towards that as well. So who do you think he's going to come back against? You know, um, I've also been hearing that he could he could be potentially coming back against Eastside People Cruz as well, and you know, Eastside People Cruz he just lost. Lost. Um, he just lost his 140 pound belt to Jose El Rayo Valenzuela. You know, I'm talking about the Lightning. You know, he took that belt at 140. But at the same time, I'm pretty sure if the money's right, the paper's good, which is Riyadh season, it most likely will be, then we could see uh, Pitbull stay around at 140 for a little longer and potentially fight Devin Haney for his first fight back. I wouldn't be mad at that fight either. You know, there's quite a few fights that we'll see. And, and, it'll be, and they're both in a good position, right? Um, Devin Haney, even though he didn't technically lose, the, the, um, the, the general consensus. Census and the imagery that we remember is definitely not of one, not not of Devin Haney winning. You know what I'm saying? It was definitely him being on the receiving end of a of, of a beatdown. You know what I'm saying? But of course, it was due to a banned substance and 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 and, and somebody partaking in criminal activity. You know what I'm saying? So uh, we will, we will see it. And uh, we, we will see how it goes, man. Esau Pippa Cruz, this would be a good chance for him to bounce back, you know, after uh, losing to El Rayo. And so it's like, oh, it's, they, they both have an upside, you know, um, for taking this fight, man. So I wouldn't be mad at Devin Haney versus Esau Pippa Cruz. I wouldn't be mad at Devin Haney versus Mario Barrios um, at 147. Um, yeah, man, you know, there's some other, other potential fights, too. I think Blair the Flair. Woo! Cobb would be a good fight. I think uh, Devin Haney coming back and fighting Adrian Broner, that'd be a good fight because um, they have that history there. So that's a good buildup. So there's a lot of options, man. Um, but if you ask me to put money on it, which one do I anticipate to happen? Uh, uh, most likely to happen, I would say probably Barrios, man. But we'll see, man. Y'all let me know who y'all think he'll fight and let me know if you're excited for Devin Haney to return. And because, um, you know, last time we saw him, he was at the he was present at the fight. Um, uh, with Terrence Crawford against Israel Madrimov, you know, and that's a big Turk card. <clears throat> that's a big Turk card right there. So, you know what I'm saying? So they, they definitely had some interactions. Uh, we, we know that. And uh, in, in, in addition to the one on Twitter, so uh, I definitely anticipate his return to be in some way, shape, or form in conjunction with uh, Big Turk Yalashik, man. But I appreciate y'all rocking with me as always, man. We're getting inside for it starts raining. Y'all be easy. Take care of yourselves. And remember, with God, we can do anything. Without God, we're nothing. The doctor's out. Peace. From the hood to college, both worlds, they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold, we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets.